The Airbus A380, once hailed as the future of long-haul travel, never received a NEO new engine option upgrade, and the reasons are tied to economics and shifting airline strategies. When the A380 launched in 2007, Airbus bet on hub-and-spoke travel, where large planes funnel passengers through major airports. But airlines increasingly favored twin-engine jets like the Boeing 787 and Airbus A350, which are cheaper to operate, can fly longer routes and don't require filling 500-plus seats to turn a profit. By the 2010s, demand for four-engine giants plummeted. Even with newer engines, the A380neo would have been a costly gamble for Airbus, as airlines prioritized flexibility over sheer size. The final nail came during the pandemic, when global travel collapsed and carriers retired A380s early. Airbus, seeing the trend, chose to focus on its A350 and A330neo programs instead. The A380's story is a lesson in market evolution. While iconic, its size and operating costs clashed with the industry's pivot to efficiency and point-to-point -point routes. An A380neo might have extended its life, but not enough to justify the investment. Airbus's decision to sunset the program in 2021 reflected reality. The era of mega jumbos is over. For aviation enthusiasts, the A380 remains a marvel, but its legacy underscores how innovation must align with demand. If you enjoyed this deep dive, smash the like button, subscribe. For more aviation insights and let me know in the comments. Should Airbus have taken the risk on the A380neo or was retiring at the right call? Fly smart and see you in the next video.